Hey everyone, it's Dee. I hope you guys are doing well. I have an estate sale haul for you guys. Um, this was a sale that I actually went to a few weeks ago and I'm just now getting around to unpacking it. So first we have Pansy who came to say hi. Hello. All right. So back to the haul. So the first thing I have is this set of eight ornaments and it's by Montgomery Ward, which I don't think we've had here in a long time. So let me see if I can open this one handed. So they're all in here and they are these flocked apples and they have a little elf sitting in there. I thought that this was so neat. I've never seen these. It says made in Japan at the bottom of one of the leaves. So it looks like we have four of the greens and two yellows and one red. I wonder why <laughs> the colors are not even. But um, anyway, I thought that that was a really good find. So I'll most likely be listing these. So. Next up, we have the Spaghetti Wear Santa. I have never seen these, this style of Santa before, so um, when I saw him, I just had to pick him up. He's just a figurine. He's not a bank or anything. And I don't think he has any markings, surprisingly. I would figure that a really nice, well-made Santa like this would have a marking, but it does not unless I'm missing it. Um, this is probably going to be listed for resale so that's why I picked this one up. So the next thing we have here is this set of bells and I have seen these at sales before but um, when I saw it at this sale I thought I'll go ahead and pick it up. I think there's a set of six of them. So there's one. This one says Happy Yule Tide, and that one says Happy Noel, I believe. They have a nice ring to them. Yule Tide greetings. Here's Dino. Hello. I can't pick you up, bud. And then we have. Merry Christmas. We have this ornament that I just threw in there. Um, he has a maiden or just a Japan sticker, maybe. Um, what are these? Oh, these were adorable. These are coasters, I think, but they are cherries. Are they cherries? No, maybe turnips, something. Um, these are the rest of the bells. And then I got this cauldron here. It is this um, copper cauldron and it does have a mark. Oh, it's one of the Teleflora ones. Okay, so I don't know what I'm gonna put in there yet, but I was um, happy to find that. Okay, the next couple of things are some paper things. So we just have this, um, paper pad. It says airmail. just has some really thin um, writing paper in here. We have this book that I actually picked up to give um, a friend um, and I still haven't given it to her so I will be seeing her tomorrow and I will pass this on. She has a few Benjamins in her family so I'll just quickly flip through so you guys can check out the um, illustrations. And then we have this one that I was excited about. It says Christmas on Stage, a book of words and rhyme and reason to greet the magic Christmas season. And it's kind of, um, it's pretty wordy, but it has like a little bit of a pop-up. Um, you can see that it's torn here, so it's not in the best condition, but um, still really neat. We have some music here. Yeah, so that was the book. 
And then another paper thing is just this um, slipper tissue. I like picking up these printed tissues when I see them. Okay, I think that was all the paper. And then I think that this apron here, this is what the tag says. And um, it has all of these images on here. So um, I've been wanting to get full size aprons because I noticed that some of the aprons that I have are half size and I just really need to be wearing full size because <laughs> When I'm cooking or baking, I, you know, I'm getting stuff everywhere. Um, that is the tag. It says nine pounds originally. I'm not sure what I paid for it. We have this linen um, napkin or kitchen towel. Let's see. We have this cat here. And then this is... Sorry, I'm trying to open it. There we go. And then <laughs> this adorable mouse next to it. And let's look at the tag. Made in Britain, St. Michael Linen. And I don't know what those numbers mean. So I picked that one up. I'm not sure if I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna keep that one and then I think I'm gonna resell this one. It is also linen. Let's look at the tag. This one's made in Ireland. Yeah, so this is a beautiful um, image of some fruit. Pomegranates. Irish linen, great quality. I feel like these would last forever. And um, I don't think this one has ever been used. The other one had a stain in it, so that's why I'm gonna keep on, keep, hold on to that one. So we have Dino here keeping us company and Princey down here. Ah, 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 sit. Good boy, good boy. So we have this nightgown here. It is this really soft, gauzy feeling, um, perfect for, you know, summer. And it does have a tag. It says made in Germany, Celestine. Um, I'll most likely list this. I haven't looked this up, so I'm not sure what it's worth. Um, but yeah, I just could... Um, you know, see someone wearing this during the summertime. And then the last thing we have is this long, um, it's like an open kind of cardigan. That's the brand. I've never heard of it. It's Sharon Young. It's a small medium and it's just like a long open um, shawl kind of cardigan thing. So that is it guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this video and um, let me know down below what you liked and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.